On the 30th of July 2017, the man of God, Prophet Abera Kebede, delivered a prophetic alert concerning San City in the northwest province of South Africa. These were his words. We thank the Lord for the today. We bless the Lord. I'm, I'm seeing something strange around Sun City, this, uh, this area. Something very strange things. I'm, I'm, I'm hearing screaming. May you stretch your hand to this side, please. Just let's, let's speak mercy. Somebody say mercy. Mercy. Say it again, mercy. Mercy. We cover by the blood of Jesus. We cover by the blood of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I don't want to go further because but just I see screaming. If anything, but we covered. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Apple. Michael, just give us an idea of the situation right now. Well, very good morning to you. Uh, based on a statement that came from Sun International yesterday at 8 o'clock, we know that there was uh, an extreme hailstorm which resulted in flash floods in the Sun City Resort, the Soho and Cabanas hotels, uh, extensive damage, a lot of videos on social media uh, circulating, just showing the flooding inside those facilities. Um, but uh, where we are at the moment, we are outside. We cannot... Uh, for the moment get into the Sun City Resort. We are not alone in that. There are a number of holiday goers that have come to the facility uh, hoping for a good time. Gentlemen, good morning. These are some of them. Uh, what are your names? Where are you from? And uh, what are they saying to you at the gate? Okay, I'm Spusi, so this is my friend Kutano and my little brother Voyo. We come all the way from Johannesburg. So now we get to the gate and then they're just telling us that the hailstorm affected so many places. Affected so many places, so that it's not possible that we can get in For because now. the places are closed. And there's no communication from the management side. So the lady at the front gate said that she doesn't even know anything. So there's no communication from the management to the customer to us, the people who who are here. To okay, so no communication from management down to those that are manning the gates here. To our reporter Michael Apple, which has given us an update after that hailstorm that left a trail of destruction at Sun City Resort yesterday. You'd be forgiven for thinking this footage was shot somewhere in Europe during a blizzard. Sun City? More like Snow City. <laughs> Technically, it's hail. A lot of hail pelted down on the resort on late Saturday afternoon. The general manager, Raul de Lima, says this has never happened before in Sun City's almost 40-year history. I'm, I'm seeing something strange around Sun City, this, uh, this area. Something very strange things. I'm, I'm, I'm hearing screaming. Yesterday's uh, thunderstorm was unprecedented. Uh, we got something like uh, 85 millimeters of rain within half an hour. It came down quite suddenly. Naturally, um, you know, that kind of water, that amount of volume of water affected uh, quite a lot of our operations uh, at the resort. About 400 of the 1,300 hotel rooms were damaged along with many of the vacation club units. There were scenes of incredible flooding throughout the resort. Any water remaining outside is being lapped up by the unforgiving northwest sun while the hail, resilient as it is, is slowly melting. Delima says it's been an enormous cleanup operation. We mobilized our cleaning teams. Um, our staff were phenomenal. I mean, we worked through the night pretty much getting the operation to the kind of state that it is today. Unfortunately, the damage is substantive. Um, it mainly affected our convention center, which fortuitously at this time of the year is underutilized. Uh, but uh, the retail areas downstairs were affected through the precipitation of rain and hail that actually came through some of the uh, roof sheeting and through ceilings and then obviously onto the slabs. This young holiday goer describes how it all unfolded for him. And, uh, all of a sudden hailstones and lightnings just started. The next minute we get a phone call from our dad to say um, houses are flooding and roofs are falling at Vacation Club. 
It may look like scenes from the Titanic movie, but that hasn't stopped the influx of people in the slightest. Many day visitors even oblivious of what unfolded here the previous day. It looks very different to how it did yesterday, but there's still quite literally a valley of waves in some of Sun City's conference centers. The general manager says it's early days, but they estimate that the damages are going to run into tens of millions of rands. Michael Apple at Sun City in the Northwest.